Compton Cowboys, it's a community. We've been doing this for about 30 years. We're trying to push positivity through these animals. We want people to understand that there's a lot more to what people think of Compton. As a kid, every day after school, I would go ride my horse. Once I got on the horse, nothing mattered. Hearing the wind go past your ears, I just always felt free. My mom rode horses professionally, so she's the one who introduced me to bell racing. Kiera was a competitor that we had to always worry about because she was really good. And so I started to chase my goal to be the first black woman to make it to the national finals rodeo. As I got older, I started to experience a lot more chaos. My brother thought that being a man meant being in a gang. So he was constantly battling within himself. You know, you hear God works in mysterious ways. Yeah, we hear that. But when you actually experience it. So this is where he fell. He was shot here, and this is where he dropped. He was 23. As a Compton Cowboy, what gratifies me is giving these animals a home. That's what we do. When we first get the horses, some of them, they out there starving. But we feed them, take them in. Welcome to your new home. You love it. <laughs> you gonna be good today, huh? The first time Kiara came to the company Cowboys, I could tell she had been through some stuff. I didn't know how she could go from being such a vibrant teenager to such a reserved adult. Saving a horse, you have to understand they experience adversities. You feel just the way that I feel. You hurt just the way that I hurt. You experience pain just how I experience pain. And when you are able to let them know, hey, you're good here, it does something to them within and they're able to be free. When you get on a horse's back, you can feel it. And it's, oh my gosh, it's, it's beautiful. You've been through a lot of stuff in your life. A lot of that stuff could have buried you. Kept on going like, all right, what's next? You feel she me? lost her brother. That's what I'm now she's my sister. I, that's, that's my sister. With all the things that we experience, we're able to come back and say, you know what? This right here never failed us. You can feel it. You can see the looks. Hey, can I touch your horse? Count it. It's negative. Nah, ain't no negative over here. This is my home. I can't never leave this. I love my people, man. Family, community, my homies. You're not in it alone. And when you know that you have a community, you can chase after your dreams. Now the time and the world that we live in, 
something has to change. We're fighting for not just our kids, but for our community.